People pretend like what we want exists in the economic system, but that's not true. What we want comes after the economic system. We don't care about what happens within an economy. What we care about is at the end what the distribution of goods and services are. So here's an example of this. Let's say that we have an economy where the worker and the owner can only earn two times as much as each other and everything is equitably split out and blah, 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 blah. Let's say that society is poor and starving. Would we prefer that or would we prefer a society with massive inequality where the poorest people, you know, can eat steak dinners every night? It's like, right? Well, okay, well, obviously we prefer the latter rather than the former. And the reason why is because we're not really, we shouldn't be moralizing the relationships that exist within an economic system. We should be looking at the outcomes that they produce after. Economic systems are just tools that are supposed to be wielded by policymakers in order to ensure a more fair distribution at the end of the day. That being said, it might be the case that a socialist form of organization achieves more equitable outcomes. However, if that is the case, we should be arguing about the outcomes produced by that system, not the inherent relationships within that system.